I say overall, it's a great experience, especially finally getting out there and seeing how the speed and everything and, you know, the different type of concepts that come with, you know, NFL teams. Overall, man, I just feel like, you know, it was something that, that I was ready for, and I'm just glad to finally be getting out there. Yeah, you make that really physical play on the first pass in your direction. Like, that kind of helped you get into, like, the groove of the game. Oh, yeah, for sure. Uh, you know, finally winning that first that first rep thrown in me. Uh, finally set my feet and getting comfortable so that I can continue to, you know, take on the next plays and perform. What was it like also making that play against a former college teammate, too? Man, I knew it would be competitive. I knew they were going to come at me, especially uh, understanding the down and distance and then, you know, where the sticks were. But, man, just, uh, you know, picking up on remembering, you know, everything, how he ran routes and stuff like that was, you know, part of it. And then just understanding what, what type of routes I was going to get in that situation. There were a couple of times, too, on the outside where they where they challenged you and you kind of, you know, met that challenge. What was it like just kind of getting adjusted to that and being able to have those opportunities? Uh, very thankful for them, you know. Just to get it, you know what I'm saying, targets and stuff like that, showing what I really can do early on and, you know, uh, man, just ready for everything that comes. How would you describe the environment just being at and just kind of getting adjusted? It's a great environment. Uh, that was probably the... The main thing that uh, probably as far as like me adjusting to, you know, the speed and everything, understanding the atmosphere and stuff like that. But man, it was a, it was a good crowd. And, you know, I'm just ready to continue to, you know, have fun in this, in this stadium and, you know, live on my, my dreams in the NFL. So are you talking to LT before the game? What was it like having him here for your first game? Man, it meant the world to me, you know, to have, you know, a family member there, especially someone that has, you know, been along with me along this journey and you know been a big inspiration and you know mentor guidance and a guardian for me you know to have him out there uh just to have him talk to me and you know give me a you know some motivational words early on and you know tell me understand that at the end of the day you know we still playing football this is where this is why i'm here and you know this is what god has placed me on this earth to do thanks Trey. appreciate y'all you have a nice night nice to meet you Stetson, Stetson was good. So he, had a, he had a couple of uh, uh, you know backwards calls here and there for sure, but for the most part, he had a lot of command. He spoke with confidence. He really addressed us, uh, uh, you know, professionally, and he he took it by the helmet. I really did respect him a lot more than that. Mm -hmm. what, what difference did you notice operationally for me for you guys? Because I know you know Coach Payne mentioned some you know, frustrations with the way things with how things went in practice and whatnot, uh, but I, unless. I mean, unless it was different, any different. I mean, just, you know, obviously when you have different quarterbacks going mm -hmm. back and forth, yeah. uh, you know, it's like different drivers of the car. Obviously, mm -hmm. different people handle differently, uh, speed, tempo, how they say the play, this, that, and the third. Um, it takes a little getting used to, for sure, especially for all of us to be on the same page as an offense. But, you know, as they settled in, each quarterback kind of gets their feel and they get their rhythm. And once that happens, we can start hitting on all cylinders and it kind of flows, you know, smoothly as you guys saw on those certain drives, yeah. You're obviously in competition for a big role on this offense. What does it feel like getting to this point after three years that you've been through, you know, the injuries and everything, and, and how confident are you that you're ready for that? You're ready to, you're ready to play every day on Sunday? Oh, I'm, I'm ready to be in every, every day of the lineman, for sure. I think that having the experience of, you know, not walking into a situation where it's kind of given to you, you know, always be put in a position where you have to earn it, and obviously setbacks and things like that, you know, those hurt. But for me, that just kind of adds more fuel to the fire. I love a good competition. You know, nothing's ever been given to me in my life, and I love the fact that they are creating such a healthy atmosphere of competition and competing and, and fire. Like, that's the kind of things I thrive on, and that brings the best out of not only me, but my teammates and everyone around me. So I love it, you know? What was it like playing alongside Logan tonight? He was at right tackle pretty much almost the entirety of the game. It's good. I think that that's his, his natural position. Um, I feel like he... He had a lot of good, great, you know, a lot of good plays, a lot of great flashes of, you know, that guy we did select in high in the draft and, you know, the, the All-American or wherever you have it. Uh, I think just being more consistent for him and just trusting that, like, when he's out there, he's in his world. 